Hello, I'm Tour Guy. I don't have a real intro, but I have this uh, real quick capture the flag game I have going on here. That's in front of you right now. That started a few. Did it? I don't even know when it started in this clip, but I didn't get to record the whole thing properly. I missed like what, maybe a minute, 30 seconds, because uh, hitting the Xbox button will make it record five minutes, a certain Xbox DVR thing, but it didn't record the full five minutes that I wanted it to and it missed a little bit but this is a really really quick CTF game that I think you might enjoy watching I don't know how fast the fastest game has been but this is probably up there that was really cool but I want to talk about this high time to kill playlist something that we have may have missed everybody has missed and I figured out a few people have definitely figured it out by now and I don't know if they shared it anywhere or maybe it was a bug and it only happened once to me and I'm just being dumb and I haven't tested it out to like try to see if it actually was a one-time thing or not but I'm gonna throw in a clip in a second when I explain this when you jump on a Titan in Titanfall 2 on the back of a friendly Titan you will pull out your gun and you can shoot from it there so like a lot of times I'll put up my, my Thunderbolt or a, a charge rifle or something if I have it I'll jump on the back of a Titan and ride into battle with him and I thought it was kind of cool to do that so I wanted to do that in the high T to kill, T to kill, time to kill playlist. But I noticed that you don't pull your gun out when you jump on the back of a Titan. And I'll show you a really quick clip here of what I'm talking about. And I've only tried this once and I recorded it and I was like, well, like, that's cool. I guess that's something that nobody talked about. I don't know it's a bug because uh, uh, Respawn did mention that the silencers are broken in this playlist, so maybe the rodeoing, the friendly cowboy rodeoing of a uh, titan, or a friendly titan, is broken too, and if they don't know about it, maybe they do, and I don't know, nobody talked about it, and <laughs> it doesn't really matter, I was kind of, you know, going for a clickbaity title, right? Nobody watches my stuff, but I wanted to see if I could start doing, uh, you know, some, like, commentaries like this, and if you hear me, my voice whistling, I do have braces, and my one tooth just moved and made a little bit of a hole and you can hear kind of a whistle in uh, when I do some S's and whatnot. So if you get bothered by that, I get bothered by it too and uh, it won't be in the next video hopefully at all. So uh, I'm gonna deal with that right now. But I have to, my, my computer's overheating now and I got that air conditioning on in the next room. I had to come close the door and I'm sitting in the heat right now because I can't turn the fan on. I'm sure all of you guys who make videos can uh, relate to that. But you can have the fan in the background, even if you get the noise removal, so it gets super annoying. But, anyways, I'm pretty excited. The uh, post plate contest that, that Respawn is doing, the montage, is uh, just ended. I'm recording this on June 21st. I don't know if it's, this video probably will be up today, I'm guessing, unless something weird happens. But that's cool. That should be announced soon. I entered that. I'm not. I don't think I'm gonna win. I, I thought I was going to win. I watched, uh, I believe it was, was it Titan Time or Titan Bros or something. They have a really good montage that probably is gonna beat mine. I was pretty impressed by my own. I got like, I, I recorded for like a month of all these different post blade clips. I got like a, a Gooser and, you know, first strike medals and like triple kills and mega, not, uh, not with the post blade originally, but like he, the post blade kills part of a multi kill of some form, whether it be three people or four people, or double, double kill doesn't really matter. And yeah, and then I thought it was really cool, and I added some extra clips of a gravity start at the end of getting kills with that direct, but it doesn't really count. No, but I was, I was pretty impressed by it. I really liked it, but not, I don't know, everybody has a different uh, opinion on that, but even if I, if you win, you get a tight, like a, a tile on the, the front page of Titanfall when you load it, and that'd be super cool. That would draw a lot of people to my channel, just like it did for Unknown Soldier. He had a lot of people watching his content anyways, but it did draw like a lot of people to that one particular montage. I was hoping that that might happen to me, but it, it doesn't matter. I, if you guys are watching this video, I'm going to link this at the very end in the end card to the montage I'm talking about, because I would like everybody to watch it, because I put... I didn't put that much time into editing it. It's, I don't like those fancy montages that do crazy edits and stuff. I don't, I don't like that. I like the, the more old Modern Warfare 2 like chill montages people used to do where it's just simple transitions, maybe even no transitions, and like decent music and good gameplay. I really like that old style and that's what I did with mine. Uh, if you guys ever watched Hutch, he used to do that and he always inspired me to make montages. 